What's up, guys? We are back, man. And as y'all can see, we can't freaking see our teams. I hope they fix that. I don't know what's up with that glitch. It's been in Madden for a while, but it is what it is. As you can see, we are on defense, and he mosses me on the first freaking play of the game. He has the Bats uniforms, and I have the Falcon uniforms. This man is running tempo. That man got Marcus Mariota over there looking crazy. Um, oh, ooh. And look at that Mark Ingram, bro. As I told y'all when I played them solos, Mark Ingram fell very shifty where the Michael Murray did. So if y'all looking for a good running back, that man Mark Ingram is, is really nice. And speaking of Mark Ingram, dude is doing crazy. He's starting five right now. Mark Ingram, I'm looking like, yo, what the heck is going on? Let me move my people over. He's about to pass. He's about to run. He hands off to Mark Ingram once again. Great blocks by his freaking team. And that dude is freaking gone. Mark Ingram, dude is a dog. I, I can straight up say that. And when I was like, okay, let me see something. What's going on here? Okay, cool. I got him over here. Let me put George in here. Let me put D Brown over there. Because I didn't realize, if y'all didn't know, D Brown has inside stuff on my team. And I didn't realize they they, they, they didn't put him in on the 3-4 uh, the odd because I start that all Olsen do. So I'm like, okay, cool. Let me have Olsen in the middle. Let me have D Brown on the other side of him. And we should be able to, you know, work things out. First play for me on offense. I hand off to that man, Tim Tebow. You know, do a little read option, see where he, you know, what he's doing right quick. So I'm like, okay, cool. Let me hurry this up. Let me go ahead and do some play action real quick. Ooh. Barry Sanders, Tim Tebow looking to pass. Tim Tebow throwing it to Jamar Chase. That man tried to do like a 360 one-hand catch, but the defender was right there to break that up. Good stuff by him. We tried to throw it to CeeDee Lamb. And this dude is just doing some weird, like, knockouts. The dude is, like, throwing his whole body, like, you know, like they showed in the trailer, like this, this man got trailer freaking techniques. I, I haven't seen nothing, anything like it. So anyway, he gets back on offense, hand off to Mark Ingram once again. And I'm looking like, bro, what the heck do I got to do? I know how to stop the run. You know, we've been doing really good with that, but it is not working out for us right now. And he knows it. You know, he's doing tempo. He's going to hurry up. Marcus Mariota, we finally get some pressure because he's, he actually throws the ball for a minute. And look at this right here. There's a ward just flies down like a bozo and gets dusted by Gabriel Davis, very underrated wide receiver. Um, dude is a great, a great freaking uh, player. You know, he he has that Keenan Allen story. If y'all don't know Keenan Allen, he made his name in the playoffs against the Broncos some years ago. And as you see, Gabriel Davis last year, he scoring all them freaking touchdowns, he made his name. So, hey, Gabriel Davis may be like that, that new Keenan Allen, man. I know he's his own player, but just be on the lookout for him. And they both route runners and stuff like that. But you see, we back on offense. Oh, you see the, the controller vibrating, the screen vibrating, because this man has full momentum. So, we got Tim Tebow. Oh, look at that dot right there, Kyle Pitts. Nice little 360 rat catch right there. And, you know, we got the first down. Still, with crazy freaking zone. Look at that. We can't enter the zone, and what, they players, what are they? Uh, players cannot enter the zone, and they can't be knocked out the zone or something like that. And we, you know, try to get par him in the, in the mix-up. I told y'all last video, Parham, that man is nice, and I just have to utilize him a lot more. I know I got Kyle Pitts, but we need to put Parham out there and utilize him if I have him on the team. It says perfect accuracy bullet pass, but somehow that was a terrible freaking pass. Come on, Tim Tebow. Fourth and four, we try to do something. That man just pushes off Megavich, but it doesn't matter. We're short, so we are on defense, man. And we get some pressure right there with Carl Banks and it is 14 to 0 as y'all can see second and 10 Marcus Mariota with all the time in the world just looking to do something He's trying to scramble around but he's sacked He's sacked by Tyler Maitovich. I told you this man is freaking nice man If y'all don't if y'all don't have Michael Parsons, bro, go get this man Maitovich because he can cover and he can blitz he can do whatever you want to he can run stop You know that guy can do nothing on offense. So we are back on offense still 0 to 14 we try to do some play action. Oh, Tim Tebow looking to pass. We throw a dot right there to Chase Claypool. He went up there and got it. Good stuff by Chase. That's why he's on the team, man. Chase Claypool. Ooh. We hand off the Barry Centers. We're getting sticky a little bit. And he hits him right there with is that uh Randy Moss on the defense. Yeah, I think he got that Randy Moss card that I y'all know I don't like that the fact that that card is in the game, but it is what it is. We gotta deal with it. We hand it off to Barry Centers. Barry Centers looking free. Oh, we try to get a face up right there. But good stuff by him. That man Jackson was right there to make that play. It is what it is. First and 10. Oh, we do a little draw play. Christian McCaffrey, 
and it gets stopped. That man got beta bits too. Oh shit, I gotta look out for that man. But I don't think he got him with the uh, abilities or whatever, so it's all good. We try to do another draw play, you know, 33. Dunk it off the Christian McCaffrey CMC touchdown, man. I don't know, I actually do like CMC a lot, man. Christian McCaffrey, I've always been a fan of him for a while, and he feels slow on my team, just like Parham. I don't know what it is about certain players. Like, if they don't start, it's like they feel slower for some reason. I don't know if that's a thing or whatever, but it is what it is. Dang, look at Mark Ingram just straight destroying me. And Kirsten Megovich gets a chance to get that stop for us. But it's first and ten. I don't know why no C B is over there on that right receiver like that. Glad he didn't see it. And we get this sack with Carl Banks. Carl Banks does have unpredictable on him. And he has off the Mark Ingram once again. I was just trying different defenses. I don't know why I thought he was gonna keep passing. But look at this dude, Mark Ingram. This man is going nuts. I haven't seen nothing like this, man. I told y'all. This man is freaking going ridiculous right now. He hands off once again. And eventually, you know, I'm like, we got to change our freaking coverage, man. This man is not going to pass, so why am I playing pass defense? So we go back to the odd a little bit. Uh, this man is looking to throw. He's looking to throw. He can't find anybody. We push him out of bounds real quick with Chandler Jones. That is the 86 Chandler Jones, not the 90, I believe. Because, like I said, this was last week before that came out. Um, so, yeah. Right now, it's 7 to 14. He's looking to do something 25 seconds to go in the second quarter. He's scrambling. Marcus Mariota, he tried to do what he did in real life in the preseason and in real life against the Saints. Y'all know I'm a Falcons fan. I was at that game. I'm still feeling it. Like I said, just like I've been saying this whole video, I've never seen anything like it. <laughs> that game was freaking nuts, man. But, yeah. But anyway, good sack right there by Olsen. That man, look at that man's speed. Hawking that man Mariota down. Third and goal, 14 seconds to go on the clock. Can Mariota do something? Let's see. Marcus Mariota dropping back to pass. He's looking to pass, and it's picked off by Zach Cunningham. I don't, I thought, I don't know what it is. Was that lag? Because I pressed triangle. I didn't think I pressed it or whatever. So he jumped afterwards. It probably could have been a pick six. And as you can see, we find that man Parham. We put him. We trying to put him in the uh in the mix a little bit. No time on the clock. We try to throw it again. We throw the Parham, but you see this man getting trailer knockouts. Going all kind of crazy stuff. And it's the third quarter, so we hand off to Barry Sanders. And I, this formation we got going on, I'm like, okay, this formation is pretty cool. We're trying to scheme up a little bit. We was calling this play and, like, changing up, like, the different routes and stuff like that. Beautiful pass by Tim Tebow. Nice touch pass to Jamar Chase, man. Beautiful freaking play. Beautiful pass. Way to start off the second half. We got to do something. We down right now. Tim Tebow, you know, I like that little... Okay, we doing we doing motion that man over, you know, Kyle Pitts. Oh, we try to get some more run blocking. Oh, that man was right there though. He, but Barry Sanders getting shifty. We didn't need it. Touchdown. We put Kyle Pitts over there. He gets dominated. And Barry Sanders had to do it all by himself. Good stuff to Barry Sanders. It seems like Christian McCaffrey is more in the field than Barry Sanders. That's how they got the formations in this playbook. I am using the John Madden NFC playbook, I believe. So yeah. He's back on offense. It's 14 to 14. Marcus. Mariota trying to do something. He couldn't do anything, man, because we changed up the defense. We disguised our defense. We're doing pretty good right now. And J. Ron Curse gets absolutely mossed by that man Jackson. I told you this man Jackson. Um, the reason why I did not get him as a canvas hero because he was not tall enough. But he does get red zone threat. But he doesn't have abilities on his man. And I believe after that, that Moss, J. Ron Curse, which I believe is 6'4", <laughs> which is nuts. 6'4", and Jackson is 6'2". He got Moss. This is the last game for J-Ron Curse. Maybe eventually if he gets another car, we will, you know, get him again. But right now, J-Ron Curse, he's getting outdated. He only has 82 speed, and uh, I think it's time for a change for J-Ron Curse. You got Moss. You got you got us embarrassed. You got this man, you know, still in the game. It's, third, it's the third quarter, and we try to, you know, do a little stuff right there. Barry Sanders, I didn't realize, but he was actually almost in the zone. Tim Tebow dropping back the pass. We get it into Parham. Parham coming up big for us, man. He's not starting, but he's actually coming up big for us. I was so happy. I was like, oh, shoot, yo, Parham. We got him and Pitts on the field. We need to utilize both tight ends. And nice little dink and dunk to Barry Sanders. You know, we, we looking good. We got CMC in there. We got Barry Sanders in there. We got Parham. And we got Jamar Chase. Jamar Chase looked like he almost in the zone as well. Marcus Mariota, 12 for 17, 202 yards. 
I mean, not not Marcus Mariota. I'm tricking. Tim Tebow, and he gets sacked by that Matt Adams. I believe that's the team captain. Uh, I think that's what they call him, Adams. But it is what it is. Third and fifteen. I'm like, you know what? Who's that idiot over there? He's looking kind of short. And you already know what we're gonna do. We're gonna moss this idiot. I told y'all I'd never get that clown with Sidney Jones. We should have mossed him. Good stuff. We know how to moss people. I told y'all we still here. Uh, it is not as easy as it was last year. You definitely have to time it right, and you have to be in better position this year. Um, last year you had a lot of leeway. This year you have to make sure you know what you're doing. Please, man, C.D. Lamb just breaking tackles, just going crazy. But we stopped that man on the 14 yard line. How did he get on the 14? Like he was on the nine, wasn't it? That's kind of weird. Maybe I'm tripping. Wasn't that on the nine yard line? Well, I don't know what's up with that. Maybe that was a mistake, or maybe I'm tripping. But he has the ball. It's 21 up. Two minutes, 34 seconds to go on the clock. He's trying to do what he's been trying to do the entire game, and that's run crazy with Mark Ingram. But we have adjusted. That man Brown stopped him. That man D. Brown. That's fourth and two. What is he going to do? It's two minutes to go on the clock. Marcus Mariota dropping back to pass. He's looking. He's throwing it. I tried to use her, but Parham is wide open. And I'm like, dang, bro. That man was just wide open. I couldn't do anything about him. But he tries to run the ball. The whole team is there, man. We ready. We adjusted. Like I said, we good. He's dropping back to pass once again with Marcus Mariota. Surprisingly, and we right there with Megavich. Good little hit stick right there. That would have been a great fumble. Marcus Mariota looking to pass once again. He tried to go five wide, and he tries to run. Olsen and Karofalis or everybody named Mama was there for the sack. So good stuff on that. Um, he couldn't do anything, so he kicks a field goal. Oh, no, he doesn't. It's off the crossbar, so it's 21-21. Mark, I mean, Tim Tebow, I keep wanting to say Marcus Mariota because we have him on the focus now. Tim Tebow dropping back to pass, and it's caught by Jamar Chase. Tim Tebow's clutch, 21 up, and y'all see we can put up conservative because we're not playing with EA Sports, and we're not by the college center. It's 58 seconds to go on the clock, 21-21. So we hand off the Barry Sanders conservative. Like I said, that's why you do conservative because like he's about to try to strip me, and he calls a timeout. You know, we run the ball. We're not doing nothing stupid. We are not going to Kyle Shanahan this, like I said before. We're handing off the Barry Sanders. We try to be a little shifty on conservative mode. It doesn't work out for us. We kick the field goal on 4th and 12. 16 seconds to go on the clock. And look at this. Ew, we just, ooh, let's go. That man, Olsen, man. And that saves the game for us. He didn't have no timeouts. 24 to 21. We get out of here with the dub, and you already know what time it is. Good game by this guy, man. And But, you know, Tim Tebow did great for us. And 24-21, Tim Tebow, two touchdowns, no interceptions. That was what it was for the game. He did great with Mark Ingram, but Jamar Chase, you know, two great plays. Lester Hayes, that is not the full one, like I keep trying to tell y'all. But Merlin with the two sacks. Is that coming to him with interception? Hey, we here, man. Like I said, J. Ron curse last game, but it is what it is. Like, subscribe, all that stuff.